Hey guys, how it going? This is the R Spark. I'm back here in World of Warships on my first gameplay. And I'm here in my tier 4 battleship, the Wyoming, a uh, American battleship. We are here on a map that looks like it needs to be captured here in a minute and 20. Um, I hope you guys do enjoy this uh, first gameplay of World of Warships. I don't usually play it a lot. I have played this much since I was in the, the beta I've been trying to get back into it and hopefully I can get an aircraft carrier soon to try them out but for right now um, we're just trying to get the enemies out of the uh, spawn and try to see if we can score some kills it looks like I got a couple cruisers here with me to protect me from uh, airplanes which I don't think I ever had any problems with to be honest which is nice uh, I didn't attend one to go left, but it looked a lot safer than right, so I decided to go that way. I, uh, spot this, uh, battleship. It's another Wyoming. Looks like these torpedo bombers are headed to, uh, help this way. Wow, it looks like it lagged there a little bit, but it looks like we're going to hit this guy here. Maybe? No, we didn't hit him. Oh well. We'll get the next ones. This was a very intense action-packed game that I usually don't get. In some games it seems like a destroyer will run right after you. Um, I'm also hoping this is not too loud, and it looks like we just <laughs> citadel the ship. Wow. That was pretty cool. That was really loud, too. So hopefully it's not too loud where you guys can't hear me. Confirmed penetration. Uh, if so, I will fix that in the future. Uh, please tell me. Looks like that's a, uh... Through, so it does have torpedoes. We hit him pretty good there. I do enjoy the Wyoming. Uh, I have the Arkansas beta from playing the beta. And I do enjoy that ship. The only problem it doesn't have uh, anti-aircraft guns. That was a pretty good shot there too. This Wyoming decides to run into the map border and be a total pain to hit. But, oh well. I focus my attention on something else eventually. I probably should have fired HE at him so I could have caught him on fire. The shot dispersion is unreal in this game too. But I'm doing pretty good damage to him. I start to get taken fire and set on fire by uh, something or another I think by him or no I'm getting hit from that uh, ship all the way back there it's probably best to try to stay calm and definitely keep on uh, maneuver so you don't get hit anywhere because avoiding shots is the best thing to do that guy just took a big old barrage I know I can't hit him like that, it's gonna bounce, so I decided to hold my fire and wait till he's actually in a way that I can hit him. I'm not sure if I can hit this battleship here or not. Looks like that Wyoming's about to get torped. Maybe, hopefully. Looks like it's aircraft torpedoes. I just took a shot there from my right. So I just turn my uh, front towards them so I have the maximum armor capability. Which is always nice. I'm trying to variable my speed so they can't predict it. But that cruiser will just keep pumping me full of HE if not careful. He's also plunging me with fire from above. So I have to try to get closer to let my armor be more effective. I'm also trying to get my guns to swing around. We keep doing pretty good damage to this Wyoming. 
don't know what he really was doing here. I'm very confused. I try to ignore that cruiser for the time being, but my anti-aircraft guns are lighting up on some, uh... Looks like fighters. Yeah, fighters. That noise. Ooh, we hit him pretty hard there. It's kind of sad we only left him on like 200 HP. I really wish I could have got that kill. Uh, you might be wondering why I'm not using the fire extinguisher. It's because I don't know what's going to happen next from this uh, battleship here. I know he's there. I just want to see if I can get rid of this guy. But it looks like he gets taken out before I can. Looks like my second battery's got that guy too. So I'm pretty happy with that. Now I'm just trying to hit this battleship. I'm trying to take on as much as I can, which is not easy. I'm trying to put long range fire in so I'm not a prime target. Getting that plunge fire is nice. I'm very confused of why this uh, Phoenix is backing up. Backing up really fast too, it looks. I really wish I could back up that fast in my Phoenix. You can see he's now going forward. You can see the back of the ship just went underneath from the momentum. Looks like we're about to hit him good or not. The dispersion rate in this game is unreal. I like it when you get shots like that or that are clumped together. It makes it so much more accurate. Which is always really nice. The ship is on fire. These cruisers are just will tear a battleship up if not careful, especially a uh, one with fast firing guns like that. But we put some pretty good shots into him with AP shells. You might be wondering why I am using H AP. I do prefer them over HE unless I'm out of having a stalemate battle or I just need to get them killed fast. Or they're low on health. I'm back on fire, but I have pretty good fire extinguishing, so I'm not too worried. I do like their gun noises in this game, but it does feel or sound pretty good. And it does feel immersive as all can believe. Um, I'm kind of curious to see how War Thunder will implement this into their game. I don't know how well they'll do. I'm also surprised how well this game runs. I kind of wish they would do something about their matchmaker in World of Tanks like they did this. Their matchmaker and this is definitely a lot better. Which is kind of upsetting because World of Tanks is their first but you can't complain too much I guess. I also aimed a little bit behind him. I should have aimed in front of him. Somehow my shots did not go far enough. I'm very confused. But it looks like he's about to get torpedoed. Yeah, he's gonna get nailed. One, two, he took two. And that last one took him out. Now we're back focused on this uh, Wyoming. Oh, this is actually a South Carolina, my bad. The one before this, but I'm pretty sure we end up capping them out, which is kind of disheartening, but a win's a win, so I can't complain too much. I walked away with three kills, but let's see if we can maybe pick up a couple more, or one more at least. He's sailing broadside onto me, so I'm going to go for it. Ah, uh, the accuracy, it's unreal. Oh, he ran himself ashore. Incapacitation, I knocked out a gun. But it looks like this destroyers here are just gonna wreck him before I even can get my guns off. I fire all I have at him in bursts to make it more accurate, but these torpedoes are just gonna finish him off. I'm just gonna make it a lot easier on him. Good, uh, good skills by that destroyer player. But not Clemson. 
Yeah, he's celebrating in chat. Good job, buddy. I was very happy with my team. It, teams in this kind of game is very, very awkward. Especially in random. I'm hoping I can do battles soon. I kind of do need to find someone to join or hopefully I can just be a mercenary. I think that's a thing. Um, I'm not all that good, but I know what I'm doing at least. So hopefully I can be good to a team and get better as I progress in team battles. Or I think that's what they call them. So I'm not too worried. Yeah, it looks like we cap out. And I'm trying to shoot over this mountain. Well, I hope you all enjoyed. And I'll catch you on the next one.